In the United States, what should you never do? Don't fly a drone in Washington, D.C. The whole D.C. area is a no-fly zone. It's a federal offense. Just don't do it. Don't try to bribe cops when you get pulled over. I had some Argentinian friends immediately pull out their wallets and start pooling their cash when they got pulled over once. Fortunately someone in the car noticed and told them to put it away immediately. Everyone, including foreigners, has the right to be silent and have a lawyer when being questioned. Don't say anything. Also, even if you speak English fairly well, ask for an interpreter. Expect consistency at TSA and airports. Don't wander off in the national parks. It's very real wilderness and you can get lost and die out there. This includes going over railings you aren't supposed to. Or off trails. People have died accidentally falling into a steam geyser that looked like normal water. Mauled by animals or left to the elements. Your large is our tiny. Your bathtub is our huge. Choose the appropriate drink size. Don't pay off the police. My dad has friends from several third world nations where it is common practice to give the police some cash when you are pulled over. However, if you try to bribe a police officer here, you'll get into a lot of trouble. If you're from England, they're called asterisk asterisk cigarettes asterisk here. Edit for clarification. Here, meaning America. Don't road rage, people are armed. If you come from a walkable country don't come here expecting the same. There are some areas with good public transportation and bicycle, pedestrian friendly streets but, for the most part, especially outside of cities, the areas are designed to accommodate cars more than anything else. The reason a lot of Americans drive everywhere is because, depending on where you live, we have no choice. Underestimate how huge the U.S. is. If you plan on driving it can take hours to not even get halfway across some states. Get out of your car and approach the cop when being stopped by a cop unless told to. No trespassing. Private property. Locked gates. Fences. Do not ignore them. We take private property laws very seriously in THR USA. Under no circumstances should you say. I'm going to shoot the President of the United States. Especially not on TV. Climb over the fence surrounding the White House. You should never do anything remotely harmful to a bald golden eagle. Sounds like a generic American meme. But it's very illegal. I feel like this should be common knowledge. But you don't run from the police. They won't tolerate that shit here. Do not interact with the wildlife. Bears. Moose. Geese. Alligators. Badgers. Bison. Turkeys. Etc. Do not feed them. Pet them. Or take a photo with them. Keep your distance. They can and will fuck you up if you try to get close. I've seen people die because they thought the bison was just like a cow and try to pet them. Or put their toddler next to an alligator for a photo op. Leave an unattended bag in an airport or Washington, D.C. Pee in public, streets or something like that. It's kind of normal, here in Brazil. In U.S. you will be put in front of a judge. Don't try to cheat the IRS. They will fuck your life into oblivion. Q. Not standing in line will get you much on love. Open someone else's mail. It's a federal offense. Walk up to a cop car when they pull you over. Try haggling at a department or convenience store. Drive slow in the fast lane. Lots of people hate that. Assume somebody is unarmed. Push on a closed bathroom stall. Those things never lock right and you never know if someone is in there. Don't smoke anywhere unless it's a specifically designated area. Hint, if there are no ashtrays around smoking is not permitted there. No one will bring you an ashtray if you ask for one. Don't cut people in line. Americans form lines automatically even when there is no signage or other types of indicators. Americans improvise line formation and get in line. One behind the other. In order of who got there first if you see a sign that says, first come first serve, you will not.
be served if you try to cut someone in line. The worker behind the counter pays attention. They will observe you trying to cut ahead and tell you to get to the end of the line. I'm American. By the way, I've stifled laughter seeing idiots try to beat the American organic line formation. It needs an acronym. AOLF. Don't screw with the AOLF. It's a losing game. Don't talk American politics in public, it'd be a massive mistake and a migraine. Not follow the verbal commands of a police officer when pulled over. Just do what they say and things will work out much better for you. If you disagree with them, go to court and talk to the judge. No use arguing with the officer. Don't go onto someone's private property. Some people think it's shoot to kill if you enter their private property. And dead men tell no tales. Never go under or at the speed limit in the left lane of a highway. Not sure of many other countries but here. Regardless of whatever movies and TV portray. Don't hitchhike. It's not only dangerous but outright illegal in, I believe, most states. Someone else can correct me on this but at the very least. Don't do it. A booty call and a butt dial are two very different things. Don't push people in crowded spaces. Don't cut people in line. Generally just don't disrespect people's personal space. Foreign tourists from specific countries. I'd assume since they are used to everywhere constantly being crowded. Tend to be very pushy and rude. Go to pretty much any major national park to find out what I'm talking about.